Sidney Crosby in the starting lineup going up against the damn fourth line. Off we go here at Nationwide. And it was great to be back in Columbus after the lengthy road trip, working his way in his Crosby to start things off. He taps one up high. Pedersen to drive, kicked out by Merzlikens all the way back to the blue line. Whirling shot by Carlson, hit Raquel. Crosby looking to sneak one in, hits the side of the cage. And now jousting with Justin Danforth. One close up look there, Jordan Harris. He's back and he did not play Tuesday in the game in Seattle. This line was great. With Sean Corrali, Kevin LeBanc, Zach Gaston Reese, the former Penguin. This is LeBanc who's going to sweep one to the left point. Christensen, quick shot, score! Christensen, let it go! One nothing, Columbus! Zach Aston Reese in the vicinity against his former team. I love this play right off the wall. It's an excellent four check here. And the crowd's in it on top of the fans, or right on top of these players. And the players are buzzing here to start. And it's a play that goes low to high, and Christensen just whips it towards the net. And you can see Aston Reese, the way he celebrates, that tells us that he probably deflects it, and yes, he does. And for Jari, he just wants to feel that puck and get some rhythm on recall, and that third shot, it passes him. Sam Poulin, his second NHL game this year. He'll move it point to point to Grizzly. Grizzly feathers one down low for Pui Arby. Pui Arby walking out with that strength of the forehand. He shoots, and that stays out somehow. Out nice and high, and that's why that shot goes high. And how about Pui Arby? Monahan's going to be in front of the net. Marchenko's going to be in the bumper position. And then Fantilli is going to be off to Orensky's right. So a completely there he goes. different formation, and the puck is on the stick of Zach Orensky. Chinikov, Orensky, drive. He scores! Power play goal! Jackets. He's usually net front, but Fantilli's going to go off to this side. Here he goes. Look at Warinsky. It's play, catch, get it back on a nice little pass, and he gets some loads. There's actually no one in front of the net there. There's no screen here. It goes through Jari's own defender. You see Monahan is stuck on the other side of the net. And Jari just can't keep up with that through the defender. There's a great look at it as Achari tries to play goaltender, but not really. It's got to be so startling, right? And then you have to just kind of oh, yeah. gather yourself and just realize everything's all right. Right. First, can I breathe? Here's Beauvillier. Slips one in front. Swing his stick. Crosby up in the air, and it's in. Beauvillier around the crease. Popped up in the air. Lands in behind Merzlikens, and Pittsburgh makes it 2-1. Everyone's looking to see what happened. The players aren't sure what happened here. This puck's going to go down. It goes up in the air and off Crosby's stick. It's up in the air high. And then Crosby gets it. I don't know if Pavilion tapped that in or not, but it's going to go off of Crosby's stick right there. It goes up in the air. And Pavilion either taps that in. Yeah. I was just going to ask you, Jody, it's like I've seen this movie before. Jackets, lots of like, up to nothing, kind of where we were the first period the other night in Seattle. But a bouncing puck and away is Puglia Yarby to the net, fought off by Merzlikens, gets the second one, it's loose, and a good block in front by Harris, it looked like an O'Connor. In the offensive zone, when they put the puck in good places, Puglia Yarby's had a good start to this game. Big, strong, straight to the net, and how about that play? This is a rebound that ends up coming right to Puglia Yarby, he pokes it, no, Elvis pokes it. Are able to shoot it over to the corner. Malkin's out of the box and looks to play this puck. He will slip it through center ice and right up ahead. Here comes Danforth. He's got a step. Danforth with the goal. Got it on net and Jari shuts him down. That's why that puck rattled around after. How about the back check there? Bunting bobbles it. Able to regather. Grizzlick walks the line. Snaps the pass over to Bovillier. Mobilier to Grizzly, stepping, shooting, deflection, save made by Merzlikens, scramble, Bunting right there, shoots and scores! Michael Bunting, it's a power play goal for the Penguins, they've tied the game up at two. And the Blue Jackets here trying to find it, after it hits Elvis, it's just a scramble, and as they do, a bounce goes Pittsburgh's way, and Bunting just fires it. O'Connor does a good job right in front here. That's that's just a mad scramble goal, and after that broken play, 
Jackson's trying to get it back. It'll be chiseled in by LeBanc. This is the energy line. We're going to recapture momentum. Rob Burrow try after three seconds. Hard wooden goal. Several purposes. Also, the breakdown of, of coverage. And here, this number is. Number three. Two minutes holding the stick. That's where the scramble starts. Whereas Leakins has his stick and he's back in the blue paint. Pedersen, Malkin, Raquel a chance. Fires. It's off the corner glass. Carlson swatted to the middle by Crosby, intercepted by Fabro, and now it's the Jackets with some numbers. Wierenski across, here's a chance, Olivier shoots and scores! Matthew Olivier, and the Jackets are back on top! Olivier fifth of the season. How about Zach Wierenski here? The Penguins are up on the play, he sees it, and he gets going, and then he gets it to the right man, Matthew Olivier. His fifth goal of the year, and he picks his spot. Jari can't keep up with that fastball. But it starts with Orensky. He jumps, creates separation. And Matthew. Carlson loads up, blasting. That changed direction off the glass. Now Bovillier. Short pass for Crosby. Crosby got position on Fabro. Slips it up high. Carlson shooting. That got through. Stop rebound. It's Robert Leakins. Incredible stop on Anthony Bovillier. For the Pittsburgh Penguins, Raquel in front of the net, that makes Elvis bobble that puck. And Bovillier thinks he's got more time and no glove, but Elvis is all glove. Feather down the wall by Sillinger for Fantilli. Sillinger, it's hands in tight, and that's stuffed down by Jari. He's going to be in that space. Two guys on Fantilli on the wall. Good job with the center for a couple games, but... He does a good job on both. He's more comfortable at center ice, more involved. Oh, oh take on sailed one score! Voronkov around the crease! And it's 4 2 Columbus! The Blue Jackets bench as the Blue Jackets win the faceoff. There's a key keep there by Marchenko. He's covering up high. He gets the puck and just throws it. Now look who's right there on the. Top of the crease, it's a big man, Dmitry Voronkov. He stands at home past Jari. And the Jackets are up 4-2. Beautiful play there. Good hustle at the line. I know Voronkov is going to be parked right in front. And right now, it's Provorov getting reorganized. Here's Dmitry Voronkov. Plows his way through. Then it's Sillinger. Shoots up high. That's stopped. And then punched away by Jari. By Monaghan and Jari with the save. How about this? Trying to step up on six foot five Voronkov, and that opens up a lane for Sillinger. I'll work on it. <laughs> Free tattoos. Barzenko kicking it free and denied by Jari. Big scramble for it. They whack away. Puck goes in behind. And now Severson shoots and scores. David Severson. the net and the Blue Jackets now through the neutral zone Marchenko with a great individual effort but he doesn't stop puck goes back to the net goes to the net again get that puck to the net and this one doesn't go to the net it goes right to Searson you see him creeping in he creeps in he creeps in look at all the white jerseys down below and then he gets the puck it goes against against the grain on Jari he labels it and look how happy everyone is for Severson goals by defense Drilled in and around the Malkin. Eric Carlson shooting, deflection, bunting, and Crosby couldn't finish, gets top line. Loose side of the goal, Raquel digging for it, kicks back in front. Mad scramble around that blue paint, and now it's Sellinger maneuvers out the center. Net empty, he scores! Paul Sellinger, and it's six tonight in Nationwide. Puts that six, six goal in the empty net. How about this stick by Provorov right there on Crosby? Right on the backside. Crosby, no. Provorov strong. He's such a steady player for the Blue Jackets. Instant presence back there. And how I love Sillinger, what he just did there. He made the move. Carlson was dipping in to play him, and he knew it. Great awareness. Fans that remain on their feet. The chant is CBJ. The Jackets fueled by the fifth line back in the win column tonight 6-2 against Pittsburgh.